Hey there, Geeks. Tim with MajorGeeks.com. Today we're going to show you how to disable or modify user account control UAC in Windows 10 or 11. So, anytime you run an app in Windows, you often get a prompt that says, you sure you want them to let this device, this app make changes to your device. So, you can disable it entirely, which is typically not recommended, or you can modify how often it pops up. We're going to do this in the registry, or we can do it right within settings. So let's start with the registry. Look for the little eye up here or check the video description, expand it to get the link to this page so that you can download our registry files, which are pretty cool. So what you do with the registry files, it makes all the changes for you. It's really easy. There's two of them in there. Double click on enable or disable. And But remember, that's an incomplete disable. So that's not for everybody. You can also do that in the registry manually I'll just show you real quick it won't take long for those of you who might want to play around we highlight this right here Windows key plus R regedit and we're gonna put this that we copied in there make sure we can see it all here and I think we're looking for I'm gonna go back and check I believe it's enable LUA yes and change the value data, value data. As you can see, it's one, that means it's on. Change it to zero, click OK, and that will entirely disable it. Pretty easy to do. Last but not least, and probably the best method of all, is to go into settings. So settings, oddly enough, opens up the old control panel. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna search. So either click your search or look for your search bar depending on what you're using if you don't have either Windows key plus S and we're gonna start typing in user account control and we're gonna look for change user account control settings so let's go user there it is right there change user account control settings there it is so you have four settings you can try it's easy to get to as you can see always notify and just read each one I use this setting right here you'll notice the only difference between these two is default and don't dim my desktop so really at the end of the day it's not that big of a deal so it's kinda like you probably want to pick one of these two. It's kind of weird too. You think you'd click here and it worked, but it doesn't. So you've got to slide this by clicking on it. If you're a little paranoid and that's okay, go ahead and leave it all the way up here. If you're not, choose this one or this one. Again, I prefer this. And you're never notify. You can see always. And that is never notify and not recommended. I've run it like that before. If you really know your computer and you're not running different apps, you're not downloading stuff, you might be okay, but I really like to, I really like to put that to advanced users. So if you're not really comfortable, pick one of the two. I'll leave it there. Click OK when you're done. And ironically, user account control settings, which we're discussing here, pops up. Click yes. Yeah, that's it. Piece of cake easy enough to do so there you go there's how you can disable or modify user account control in Windows 10 or 11 they're virtually identical there you have it bottom right corner you know the drill subscribe thanks for watching as always see ya